I'm streaming, by the way. Honestly, I'm not. Cool. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure how much successfuls is, but like I always play adjustments by ear, so it's. Per so like I feel like six will make you perfectly audible, if not louder than me. <laughs> we'll find out. We'll find out. We have no choice but to. All right. Welcome, everyone, back to Astral Chain. No, we're not on the title screen. I don't want to risk running into a... I don't want to risk our checkpoint being ten minutes back. So this is quite literally exactly where we left off before. What the... Also, I just noticed this. What the hell is this unchained mode button? <laughs> I mean... Not something you can access, apparently. God, like, I bet you it's one of these stupid, like, it's one of these stupid achievement things. Probably. Also, could you reset the call? It's clicking at me. Ooh, yeah. Can do. Ooh. Yippee. Yeah, like, God, shout out to the fact that if you get an S plus on all cases, I'm sorry, wait. In S+, plus, on all cases, on PT Standard and PT Ultimate, in order to chain, in order to get a new voice code for the iris. That seems like a lot. <laughs> it's very interesting. That seems like a lot. Meanwhile, if we get enough red cases done, we can get a new hair color. <laughs> Skin tone preset, lesion color, premium material code, material code, material codes. You know, lots of nonsense. I literally, I just, I don't know what it would give you. Oh, complete every order for the ultimate acolyde. That is so much. There are so many freaking orders. There are so many orders in this game. This game feels like it would be a nightmare to 100%. Literally, I have talked about the post game for this game, which is a hundred distinct combat arena challenges, each of us take each of which takes five to ten minutes apiece, mm. which is too much. <laughs> Why do I have the gun out? Oh, cool laser! Oh no, that's just a thing commanders do. Apparently, they generate lasers. Oh, of course. Of course, of course. Man, this is a game, ain't it? This is like one of the games we play. I feel like this is gonna be one where like six months from now we're gonna forget we ever played it. <laughs> Probably. All right, I know the game's the game's probably like a little quiet from what a little quiet to those guys, but you know what? I'm gonna turn it down more. <laughs> game's not important because of all the futzing I did to my setup. This game is like an assault. Although I w although just to compensate, I will turn up this audio by like three decibels. Which is still way less than I'm actually changing it by, but you know. Right, yeah, let's see. I'm in the yellow, but that's like... Literally so much work goes into making this in the yellow for me. It's literally capped out in OBS. Oh, the game is resting at a nice, comfy, slightly less than half. And babe, if you would say something... Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, you're heading up towards the yellow range, so... Yeah, that's probably fine. I don't know how... I actually have no idea how useful these bars are. Man, babe, do you want some gasoline jelly? <laughs> Irresistible ingestible biofuel that boosts energy refill and critical rate. Does it taste like gas? Babe, I think it's quite literally just ethanol if you could if you could eat it. What a hell. 
Then we have Megabyte Milk, Cream Puff Soda. Cream Puff Soda sounds terrible, actually. That sounds like it would be so sugary. Tastes like, it seems like it would taste like, like, cream soda if you somehow managed to add more sugar to it. Like, if you put powdered sugar in the bottle. <laughs> yeah. Extra bitter coffee. Bone potage? <laughs> oh, you know, the, the bone potage. Fishy water. Ugh. And golden tea. That's just, that's just, that's just fish broth. It is. Oh, <laughs> God, shout out to Ace being the fastest of lesions. God. Like, I don't think I'll use them for combat that much, simply because uh, the only reason to use them in combat is for range attacks, and like... Oh, right! I forgot I slotted Ace with the ability that makes him explode when you summon him out. <laughs> I forgot Ace did that, okay? How could you forget about our dear friend Ace and all their cool abilities? God, I think I need to turn that off. Right, Legion Rush, which... Oh, man, what an existing skill. Let's go with... Yeah, let's go with Sync Heal instead. Like, I'm not going to use... Like, it's not that useful since I don't really use Ace in standard combat, but you know what it... You know how it is. You know how it is. With spaghetti, specifically. Also, yeah, the fact that these lasers one-shot the Chimeras... Oh, it's a lot. Alright. Oh, right. I think I need, I need to take a picture of that. For the compendium. Gotta take some, some sweet pics. Ooh, what's this? E convert 5%. Okay, so it's just like more energy per damage. Hmm. Also, if you're somewhat concerned about how annoying it seems to like keep track of the lesions, uh, there is a radial menu. It's just that I've kind of trained myself to just tap through it for what <laughs> I need. Rachel's just built different. Literally, nothing would break the flow in a video game harder than having to quick tap through. Than, like, having to open up a radial menu every time you want to do stuff. Yeah, especially for a game like this that seems like it wants to be a high-tension action game sometimes. God. Man, can't wait till we get out of Kel just so we have the super sprint. <laughs> God, don't you... Oh, nice. Earring. Hell yeah. We're just gonna use... We're just gonna put this random earring we found in an exploded subway into our ear. Yeah, you know, that won't, that won't get you infected at all. I promise. I think the funniest part is that, it, is that the game calls it a minimalist earring. <laughs> it... it Hearing that is a perfectly blank circle. Minimalism. Yeah. I'll be completely honest, I'm actually kind of lost right now. <laughs> this level, um, definitely designed. It is. This level is like laid out like it's a Silent Hill map. Um, You're not wrong. <laughs> there's like, there's very little direction and all the hallways kind of look the same and you get lost very easily, but this is, I feel like this was not their intention. Nah, it's just a little confusing if you want to do stuff. And look, it's the goops! Oh, I love them! Little Final oh. Fantasy frog slime things. <laughs> These things are wildly out of place with every other enemy. It's Zeus! Ooh. Why is it called Zeus if it breathes fire? Oh, you know, Zeus famously associated with fire. Thanks for the iframes, buddy. <laughs>
Take those gene codes, thank you very much. <laughs> I, I desire plushes of these guys specifically. Yeah, it's great. I bet you that pull thing is only there because it was in Revengeance. Oh yeah, probably. This, this game is definitely feeling like they're like, oh, we did so co cool and good on Revengeance, we should do that again. Um, and then they just kind of pulled random aspects of it. Yeah, but not in a good way, because in Revengeance, the, uh, the spine pull is like a thing you got for being for being precise with blade mode. Yeah. Which uh, is not the case in this game. You just get it for dropping their health bars. And once again, they had health bars this time, but they mo but most of the time they don't have health bars. Like, am I supposed to use my am I supposed to use my iris to get their health bars? If so, that seems annoying. Yeah, I guess I gotta, like, ping into the iris to get the health bars. Oi! What a hell. Dude. Oh, right, I forgot. Slutch for the Nintendo arms. Their thing is that instead of, like, attacking, they would just yank an enemy towards you. What the hell? Why is why is OBS telling me about Twitter? <laughs> it's important. You need to know these. Like, babe, you can't see my setup, but there's now just a random bar underneath the underneath the capture window that says like Twitter yesterday at 3:42, and then to the right of it, stream pause, which is being cut off. Oh. I am now going to open my copy of OBS to see if it's doing that there. Fascinated by whatever's going on on your on your end. I don't know. Like my best bet, my best guess is that's like a weird timeline thing, but I don't know. Don't know why it's here. What it is, honestly. <laughs> what if I just minimize and then? Okay, there we go. I don't. I minimized it and reopened it, and the bar's back to normal. Because now it's just like a select mode. <laughs> I don't know why it said Twitter. I don't. I don't, know, like, I don't know. I don't know what kind of. Like, obviously that was like a glitch, but why does the OBS know what Twitter is? <laughs> Maybe they're trying to work on, like, Twitter integration? Maybe. Uh, Maybe. Much to think about. Maybe. Alright, well now that we've done that, we now get to run further in, so now- Alright, oh, that was actually all the civilians. All right, Alicia, you really, you really had the most passive way of saying that. Oh, you know, we're kind of dying. Like, Alicia is not a cool and flappable badass. None of these, none of our side characters really have any personality. It kind of sucks. Yeah. Wait, what's? Okay. Wait a minute. No, I still need to go further down the train. I guess. <laughs> No, well, this is the furthest down the train you can get. Does it want me to take the other exit up here? Like, I get there's, like, a little yellow ring light, but it's so hard to see. <laughs> Ooh, doggies. Ooh, doggies indeed. <laughs> Hey Alicia, I found medicine on the floor. <laughs> wait, wait, before we do anything else. Alicia, don't you know there's red matter here? We gotta clean that up. It's a hell ha- Also, howdy Gorpez. Hey Gorpez. It's fine. What you playing? Yeah, it's literally fine. You are never obligated to show up, I promise. Yeah. Also, How's the audio this time? Because last time we asked, because checking over the last stream, uh, it was very out of sync. Pe Ooh. Some people were very, like, everyone who wasn't me was very quiet. <laughs> you can't believe you were silencing us. I love how I'm not allowed to jump over this. 
No, no, gotta go, gotta take a long way around, babe. Come on. Of course, of course. What do you think this is? Super Mario? Oh, nice, nice, nice. Master Duel's very fun. Ash cannot... Ash refuses. I've, I've refused to engage with Master Duel. I think it's funnier if I don't. I was li listening to YouTube play it last night. It like all went over my head. Master Duel is there, so I can... Wait! Whoa, wait. Oh! Okay, so those posts also count as being things I can, like, run the thing thingamajig off of. I never use Round Sword. I should. Because it just literally constant takes the damage. Ah, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I haven't checked, but I have made mild alterations. Are you kidding, Lenny? Come on. <laughs> Mr. Leonard's trying his hardest, babe. He's trying his hardest, but as always... <laughs> there's another doggy here. When did you get here, buddy? Okay, so wait. No health bar? Okay, so I do have to, like... I do have to run the iris over them to get health bars. That's kind of dumb. Especially since it's not tutorialized. Well, hang on. Ah, uh, and ask for that. I'll take it. It seems like very hard to not get an S rank if you know what you're doing, I'm gonna be real. Like, it, cause literally S ranks are just, have you done a variety of things? And that variety of things is quite simple, honestly. Alright. Well, we gotta deal with the Terrorismo, babe. Why is this tr Oh, wait. Here we go. Why is this subway even open? <laughs> oh, you know, everyone's favorite subway. The one that just dunks you into a pit. Like, literally, why is it open? You can just be over here. <laughs> But no, yeah, babe. Master Duel is fun, it's great, it fucking sucks. Course, you should play it. No. Fair enough. <laughs> Look, I've got one horrible time sync game, and that is Sims 3, and you will not convince me to pick up any other. Fine. <laughs> All right, babe. Oh, ah, damn. Looks like the train's out. We're not gonna be making it to the meetup today. Oh, damn. God, what was our route again? We were supposed to take the red line, and then we were supposed to cross over to the silver line, and then the yellow line, and then the purple line, which is even on this one for some reason. Why would they not purple list line, all the lines? Purple line routes at another station. It just doesn't meet up here. Yeah, and like. God, why is this map so saturated? <laughs> this, the, the power in this LED screen, you, you get flashbanged <laughs> by it. Look, they don't... They literally don't have good lighting in here. They've got the stuff on the sides and that one LED screen to cover up the middle. You really cool. saved my bacon back there. Thanks. <laughs> I always figured I'd be the one helping you. Call it a motherly instinct or something. Thanks, Alicia. Aw, oh, you didn't hear that, did you? Never mind. Not like your old man ever picked up on it either. Yes, I'm well aware you had a crush on the dad. Everything doesn't always work out the way you think it will. <laughs> Gotta be awkward. Wow. Oh. Alright, babe, time for the Yakuza cutscene. <laughs> starting to forget Forgot whether about we're on the or on a date. Wait, what's that? <laughs> Relax, old man. Lady. Yeah, you're, you're funny. I had no idea you could, like... I can't get rid of all these. Right, you can ping people, I guess, in a Twitch chat. <laughs> oh my god, can you? 
uh, well, I'm looking at it. The stream chat has literally lit up Gorpez's message in red and outlined my name in a white box. That rules. So, babe, this why are you... For evil. Yeah. So, babe, why are you swiping the fox? <laughs> don't... I don't know. <laughs> Scary. Foxes... Foxes are not his brand. If she gets wind of this, I'm gonna get killed for copyright infringement. I think Swiper qualifies as being bad fox rep. Yeah, sure, sure. But I should probably find one who can take care of herself first. Don't you think? We've been watching these two fail to flirt with each other. You know what? You know what? Alicia. You know, flirting's hard to write. I understand. Um, <laughs> this is, this is not it. Literally, literally. Like, there's being oblivious and just kind, and just being stupid. Yeah. Once again, I think the pacing on this game would have been better if we had had way more time to see this team in action before things fell apart. Right? Because it's literally like, like you'd... Like, the only time you really see these guys working together is during that one scene in the prologue where they pull your ass out of the fire, and during that one scene in in the second file where they pull your ass out of the fire. God. It's, it's so lame, because they get set up as so important, and then they aren't. Oh, there's Deimos. You know what that means, babe. <laughs> More pictures, because they put the suicide bomber enemies in. Yippee. Quick, again? after them. <laughs> They're littering. <laughs> How dare they destroy our beautiful city. <laughs> How dare they leave their goop everywhere. <laughs> Who cares about the fire? Someone else will fix that, but the goop. The goop. <laughs> this could make people really sick. <laughs> this will be terrible for the trout population. <laughs> ah, shit, the trout population. <laughs> oh my god, game, please tell me I'm allowed to do this. Yes, I am allowed to throw myself into the pit. Hell yeah. Alright, Ace, give me my item. Hello? <laughs> Literally, Familiar how? Literally, I did not know that was there. Why is it there specifically? Also, I don't, I don't know. Uh, options, audio, Iris voice setting, voice A. Literally, who the fuck is that? <laughs> you know, man. Is that- is that Max? Iris, shut down. Maybe? <laughs> it's such a small clip, it's impossible to tell. Not to mention, it's got like a bunch of, you know, things on it. <laughs> Quickly, babe, we gotta help the trout population. What's up, Gorfess? What's going on? Yeah. What's going... Like, you know... Like, we're free to talk as much as, you know, random strangers on the internet can talk, really. Yeah, like, don't, don't start using this as, like, a therapy replacement, but, like, if you want to chat... Yeah. We are attempting to avoid the major pitfall of streamers, which is having such a rabid fan base that they'll start writing fucking trans fanfics about us. <laughs> I literally, if I see anyone do that, I'm I'm legally allowed to hunt them for sport.
literally like just don't. Ah. Ooh. Ooh. I hope. Yeah. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah, that's pretty bad. I hope they're safe. Yeah, it's safety first. Yeah. Oh shit, golden slime. This fucker. Like, I think there's a lot of pressure on like trans kids to to come out as soon as possible, but legitimately your safety is way more important. Literally no one Ah, okay, well that helps a bit. Uh, assuming the mom is cool, but you know. Yeah. That's yeah, better. Yeah, I hope they're doing all right. Yeah. It it really sucks if your parents aren't like cool about stuff. Looks like I won't be of much use from here on. The rough stuff is up to you. Here we go, Dano C9. <laughs> oh right, it's on fire. How silly of me. Of course, of course. <laughs> God, everything's just on fire in this level. Sure is. Oh, right. I want to do power charge. Ow. <laughs> oh, shite energy. Ooh. Hell on earth. Well, you know what? That's better... Better than nothing. Yeah. Got that power boost. The boost off of power charge is actually, like, kind of ridiculous. <laughs> It's like two and a half times the power. Alright. There goes Ace. Well. Here comes Ace. I have no <laughs> idea why he charged up so fast, but I'll take it. Excited to get back in there. Ah, right. Come on, Ooh, can I not? I've heard, I've heard the UK um, dealing with quite a bit currently. Unfortunately accurate. Use my power. Oh, that was kind of a boring fight, honestly, because I just peppered it. I mean, like, like it sucks over there, but neither of us live there. Yeah, I I only know what I hear secondhand. Yeah, same. All right, we got rid of Deimos, the big flamer, who. I gotta be honest, not a huge fan of that fight, just because, like, he was on fire most of the time, and when he wasn't, he was actually, like, really hard to approach. It's certainly a way to design the fight. Yeah. 
Yeah, like I hope they're doing good. I know I know the heat's like really bad over there. The heat's bad and their government is having a moment. God. Get out of the red dimension. I'm sick of the red dimension. Literally, babe, we're gonna come back to the red dimension every fucking chapter. Every mission we go to the red dimension, it's not that interesting. It's not. Like, the red dimension's cool, but it is just a bunch of cubes floating in space. God. Besides, now we gotta face the beast nemesis. Man. Creature. British candy? <laughs> Better than ours. God. I do remember Thomas getting some fucked up British candy from some of his relatives. But you're the only one who can stop that thing. Literally, it's so hard to connect with the sync attack punch. It, it seems hard, yeah. Ah, shite. God, Round Sword is actually, like, really effective at just ruining something's day. Oh man, this guy has missiles? Oh, that's easy enough. But, there it is! Go! Idiot! Oh my god! Dude, are you feeling okay? Literally, you keep giving me ammo. He knows he's in a video game. He does. It's great. Ah, shy, I could have grabbed him. <laughs> <laughs> that looked right. This is the most normal video game the world's ever seen. Ooh, so you can dodge. Yeah, that looked right. <laughs> Mother fucking damage zones. Arms! Get his ass! Arms for the Nintendo Switch, please! Sludge for the Nintendo Arms. Oh, congrats on the, uh, the cheesecake. Oh, hell yeah.
All right. And we are officially welcoming Arakel to the team. <laughs> that Finally. didn't. Funny doggy. All right, let's get going. <laughs> S plus. Huh, look at you, hot shot. I can see why the commander likes you so much. Just, uh, don't let it get you in trouble, okay? Like I said, you gotta know when to run. If anything happens to you, I don't know how I'm gonna... Face your old man He's totally real and anyway, alive I'm and fine. We're not but wearing we his armor. Just, uh, just, but, hey, yeah. You've got my old beast legion now. She'll take good care. See you back at HQ. <laughs> oh, thanks, Lou. Lou with the marine wildlife facts again. Oh, what's nice is Arakel here has an auto dodge. To an extent. If you're riding if you're riding them, they do apparently have a chance to just dodge automatically. Or, you know, you can just dodge like a normal person. God. <laughs> Alright, I'll let it, I'll let him charge up. Ooh. Gotta be honest, don't actually like snow cones that much. How could you not enjoy the simple pleasures of shaved ice? I'm very sorry. Alright, yeah, this is just a platformer, babe. It's a platformer with weird controls, I guess. It is. Simply need to live with it. Oh, I thought you plumbed it to your death. What do you think? God, I wish I had, because now I gotta run around again. <laughs> Look, shockingly enough, riding a doggy does not lend itself towards self- towards, uh, controlling. Yeah, no, that looks like it controls... awkwardly. Yeah, not to mention Arakel here ha bears the distinction of being the only grounded lesion. Quite oh. fast and zippy, but, uh, can't fly in the air like the other lesions. So, not as good for doing pulls, but very good for, like, generic transportation. Oh no! Oh no! Literally not even a problem. Alright. Literally... You know what? Yeah, hey Lou. You know what, I wouldn't be surprised if that was actually Akira's voice. Maybe. We, we keep skipping all this dialogue, so I can't be sure. Yeah, a little hard to say. <laughs> but uh, he sucks so much, you know? <laughs> I, I wish he died. Hand and horrible hand. <laughs> Beautiful. So yeah, Lou, how's it going on your end? Uh, pretty good. I've been losing my mind trying to figure out why my phone won't connect to my laptop on Bluetooth. Oog. Because it will connect for like three seconds and then disconnect automatically. Okay. That's very strange. Yeah. So we can't do that thing because we don't have axe. Because we don't have the axe lesion. I find it very funny how we've got Leonard, Arrow Ace, Arakel, and also Arms, the Nintendo Slutch. <laughs> <laughs> like, one of these things is not like the others. <laughs> one of these things is perfect. Yeah, one of these things is the name of someone we actually know. <laughs> Wonderful. Someone who called dibs. Yeah, Arakel was very excited. Excited in the sense that they actually made the root quest, but they didn't make it to me. Of course, of course. Okay, cool. 
It's these thingamajigs. By the way, did I ever photograph the new... Yeah, I photographed the she-type. Oh, right, you can just spit. Are you kidding me already? Where is it? Gorpus, what the hell is a Jerry? The world may never know. <laughs> A mystery, truly. There it is! There's the fucking thing. I'll take that heal, thank you very much. I gotta be honest, I kinda struggled to see the use of half the titans in standard combat. Yeah, they seem funky. They're very situational as a thing. Cause like, arms legion combo... Cause the way Slutch here combos with weapons makes them kinda weird. Like, I... Is it the gun? Again? No. No, I think Arakel here actually synergizes with a heavy weapon. No? No, yeah. Arakel here synergizes with uh, the generic. Alright. You know, let's give Arakel a chance to, like, do some damage in the next fight. <laughs> Like, I can enjoy having options. The problem is just that these options are somewhat strange. They're, they made decisions designing this. Yeah, not to mention is not nearly as responsive in standard control. Do we jump down? I can't imagine where else the level would be leading you to. Yeah, but... Yeah, but what about this? I don't trust the level. Oh my god, these things? Seriously? God. Welcome to combat. Hell. Wonderful. I'll take that. I mean, that's good. Oh, right. Remember the fact that Leonard just breakdances? <laughs> Wonderful. Oh, right. I haven't bought the upgrade that lets me actually sync attack off of Arakel yet. Right. Oh, great, this guy. Oh, boy. hate this stupid drone. This drone is the biggest disappointment I've felt in any video game. Oh, cool. Now we have a tracking mechanic, babe. Oh. Alright, real quick. Let's upgrade the Beast Legion with at least the Sync Attack. <laughs> ah, funny doggy. Funny and dog. literally probably one of the strongest skill, one of my favorite skills in the game, Howl, which just stuns everything in a huge area. <laughs> yeah, like, I gotta be honest, I mostly don't use the Beast Legion for combat. Like, I will occasionally dip into him to use Howl. Mm. Sync Keep. Briefly retain boosted stats and ability effects after dismissing the Legion. What a strange upgrade. <laughs> like, that's something you use specifically when you're running out of power. I guess. 
Uh, we don't... Well, we gotta buy one of these if I want to buy attack up. So let's get the one that's at least a little unique from power... Now nah, let's just get power charge. Always good to have more options, even though I'm never going to use it on this guy. Alright. So let's see. If we go down, what do we get? Yes, we are just going to sit here upgrading for a bit. Here's... Oh, right. If you parry, now you can do a sync attack. Where... <laughs> God, I love that one, actually. That's definitely my favorite. Because <laughs> it's literally just Arako going salami sicko mode in an area. Salami. <laughs> literally, it probably says something that salami sicko mode is just part of my vocabulary now. You kept bringing that probably. up during Metropolis. It was something else. <laughs> Yeah! You got a lot of funny one-liners. <laughs> Anything else I've got? I don't know, you just say things sometimes. Alright, yeah. let's, right, let's take Autobind. That seems like a pretty good skill to have. Let's see, Howl on top. Autobind in the bottom. Cooldown 26 and 10. Imagine waiting 30 seconds to use an ability. <laughs> Couldn't do me. Yeah, that's way faster than doing it with Lenny. Alright, well, time to sniff out a drone. Because drones smell, apparently. Yeah, you know, those, those scented drones. I think Gorpez is talking to you, Lou. <laughs> what? I think so. I think Gorp has mangled a word in there. <laughs> I mean, he's right. There is no guy in this call. There is, in fact, no guy in call. There isn't. But I am fine. I'm still fucking losing my mind over Bluetooth. <laughs> Lou is suffering. Lou is the inheritor of the curse. <laughs> I don't know why, because everything that I connect, everything else I connect to my laptop via Bluetooth and vice versa works, but for some reason, my phone feels like not doing that. <laughs> Arakel's ability to, to cross small gaps with a dodge is really annoying, because Arakel has a bit of a turning radius. I know it doesn't seem like it, but who boy? Shut. Up, oh, dude. Stupid drone. This drone's the biggest disappointment I've ever felt. Literally, why do you talk like this? Why, why, why did they make it like a cute little robot friend and then just make it sound like a dude? Shut up. Literally, strange. Literally, how? Shut the hell up. <laughs> why are you Don't broken again? This to what do you say? Help me out for old time's sake? No, babe. That's literally this guy's name. Aww. I would love an EMP. <laughs> I'm gonna send the EMP into this game. I hate this stupid drone. You know what? Why don't I just check your iris data myself? Whoa, wait a minute. You got the Beast Legion back on its leash, huh? That could come I'm gonna beat this guy up. See if it turns anything up. I'm going to strangle this thing. I don't care it doesn't have a neck. How's <laughs> losing drone privileges? You, you can figure it out. I believe in you. We're gonna go find this fucking the axe lesion and use that to strangle this guy. God. Alright, so let's see. Is there a funny doggy point here? No? Well, let's look around, I guess. There it is! I find it immensely funny that for all this power- SHUT! <laughs> uh. They said, what if we made Otacon with none of the charm? Uh, then they did. It's an organic motor drive battery. There's a special fermenting agent inside, but you'd probably rather not know what. There's booze in this drone? <laughs> oh hell yeah! This drone is strong.
Why is why is fucking Hal giving us the Beast Legion tutorial? They, they need him to do something, I guess. Why not have Alicia do it? Considering that's literally like Alicia. This is literally Alicia's old Legion. No, Alicia doesn't get rights. All right, funny doggy time. It literally didn't let us through here until after I did this. There was simply no way you could have gone through this. There it is. Literally, dude, I don't care what your parts are. Dude, how do you keep missing components? What? In what? How does he keep losing them? Is this the thing held together with scotch tape? Are you kidding me? There's a third one? God. I fucking hate the shield class. <laughs> okay, what's this one's? Oh. Oh. Real quick. Arakel, dig! Arakel used dig. It was moderately <laughs> effective. I do not know what that line is from. Uh, I guess my pop culture reference uh, knowledge is all over the place. Gravity Falls. It's the line Bill Cipher used when he was when he was first like leaving the scene after being summoned by Gideon that one time. Uh, oh. God, I should finish Gravity Falls. Like actually. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> Alright, down! Get in there! Like, cause I watched season one as it was airing, and then the two year gap between seasons, I just dropped off. That's fair. And didn't watch the rest of it. It was alright. <laughs> it was fun. Weird shell, but very fun. I love how the I love how Arako can just like spit out bombs. <laughs> it's great. The power to do this every day. Like a little awkward, a little awkward to use, especially with how some of these combos work. But hey, I'm having fun no. with them. It's like it's not like you're really changing your. Like honestly, I'd prefer it if the le if changing lesions change your entire combat style rather than just changing what your super moves are. Like it feels like it should change your entire combat style, uh, just to make things interesting. Yeah, but no. Like no. they didn't want to go the extra mile. They're cowards. Literally, it would make so much sense if you, like, took on chunk- if you had, like, took on qualities from the Legion's fighting style. Just because of how synced you are with them. <laughs> with the only exception, of course, being Leonard, because he is the Sword's Legion in default. Literally, literally, why did you do a dog pun? <laughs> dog he, puns are great. <laughs> he's the one getting to make the funny puns this stream. It's funny doggy hours here in Neuron. And we're fucking... We're here for doggy, not for Hal Dudesmith. Literally, I don't know what his last name is. He's tech he's technically one of the disenfranchised citizens from Sector 9, but we don't know about that yet. Mm -hmm. I don't know. He's got stuff going on. Nothing exciting, but, you know, stuff. <laughs> I mean, thank you. At least it wasn't someone talking to me. <laughs> Alright, you gotta kind of... Literally, uh, I love using Arakel. Does not work for, like, standard... Does not work for anything other than transportation if you're using them as a lesion. Unfortunate. Because Arakel... Arakel is grounded and handles kind of weird on the ground. 
It looks like they turn strangely. They do. That's like most of the red matter. <laughs> also, I love how I specifically it's a person who makes those break, not Oracle. No, it, your weight is what causes them to break. Oh, cool, we got the achievement for getting 8% of the red matter. That's fun. Nice. Time for a sliding block puzzle. <laughs> Everyone's favorite. Man, why even have that, honestly? Because we gotta use it for the sliding block puzzle in Chapter 8. God. Because that one's like a whole fucking thing. Alright, Slutch. Thanks for your help. <laughs> now let's go! Yippee! Literally, why is there- why does the dodge on Slutch take up a third of your energy bar? You know, because you had the gall to use it. Oh. He's a chunky guy. You're right, babe. I will never financially recover from this. <laughs> Man, don't you just love the super exciting red dimension? It- like, it would look cool the first time, and then you went there every chapter. Yeah, babe. What if we went there again? Oh. Could you imagine going there? More than once. Like, so here. much of the bad pacing is just because you get stuck in the red dimension for like half a chapter doing nothing. Yeah, it's a it's a lot. There's those shapes again. Whatever they are. Oh hey Jenna. Oh. Then they were brought here. How does the how does he know? I mean, he's hacked into the Neuron database. I can't remember if he's like a freelancer who's working with Neuron, or if he's just hacked in. Still seems pretty bad. Still, still seems pretty bad, miss. The whole planet is, it's being destroyed. Maybe if it wasn't cubes. <laughs> literally, they're saying, oh yeah. It's not that the Earth is being eradicated. It's literally being ripped up and brought here piecemeal. Why don't we get to ever see that? It's just getting turned into cubes. It really is, Jenna. You it should have really finished is. the job. <laughs> should have tried harder. Yeah, I've talked about the pandemic. It's whatever. Yeah, you know. Literally, if you did, literally, how would you know about the pandemic before this point, other than like reading Akras of the file? Thanks, Jenna. Yes. This is like a genuinely interesting story, V. Why did they not do more with this? It's because they don't know how to do cutscenes. Bump. That aren't... Look. The cutscenes are either bombastic, like in Revengeance, or they're like this, which is trying to be serious. Especially around that man. 
I love how even though she's covered in grime, she still has a face full of makeup. Yeah. Literally, don't you love how they're obviously setting her up as to being some kind of anti-hero? Yeah. You still kill her, though. Of course. Why would you? Because this story, this game has no concept of proper pacing. <laughs> so Jenna Anderson wanna... will just get killed at the end of chapter 9. That'll be the last we hear of her. Literally, I don't even... I think she doesn't even get brought up after she gets poofed. Awesome! I love how Gorp has posted a random quote, and I'm like, not... and I just knew exactly what it was. <laughs> like, I haven't even... Yeah, I haven't watched Gravity Falls in forever. Thanks, Jenna. Alright. So, we know these cubes are used to make chimeras, which are used to make lesions. So, yeah. these aren't chimeras. These are the proto lesions. Ooh. Yeah, this is what Leonard looks like without his armor. Oh. Okay, yeah. Lappy's hat and the hair are helping like are actually like helping a lot with keeping her face from being horrible. Alright, oh, I gotta like pan it over them for a second. <laughs> ah, I was trying to do a lay attack. <laughs> Suffer for that. Pain and agony on planet Earth. God. All right, let's go. God. God. That took a while. That took longer than I felt it should have. Yeah. Like, those are generic enemies, I think. They're just used, they just have their health bars boosted since that's a boss fight. I'm trying to get a hold of you. 
Oh. How are things going down there? Oh, hey, uh, the civilians who got trapped in the subway are all right. Jenna got away before we could get Yeah, Hal's working with the Yeah, Hal's working from home for the Neurons Tech Division. Hey, wait, wait, I see, I see. Hey, hey, who is this? What are you doing on this channel? Oh, I, 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 I'm just a friend. Wait a minute. No civilian should be able to access this channel, and I think I know that stuff. You're from the technical division. How, right? Yeah. I can't believe they actually named this dude Hal. Okay, now I know it's you. The ace programmer of the technical division, who never actually comes into the office. You know, for someone who stays inside all the time, you sure do manage to get in a lot of trouble. Okay, this may be the first you've heard of him, but Hal's one of us. He's a programmer in Neuron's technical division. Did we just not tell them? They just, they, yeah, I guess not. I guess, like what, did we just never have a formal debrief after rescuing the Arrow Legion? No. Neuron snatched him up from high tech. Wonderful. Nightmare. circles around everyone else. But, uh, meat space isn't really his scene. Most people don't even know he exists. And everyone who does thinks he's a weirdo. So it's nice that you two Jesus, Olive, be nice to him. Like, Olive, you're his boss. Olive, Olive, I think you're gonna get an HR complaint for this. I mean, technically, Olive isn't his boss because Olive only becomes head of Neuron after the game, but nah. <laughs> she will be his boss. I'm just teasing you, Hal. Okay, Alicia's on her way back now. I'll get the details from her. Come on home. But be careful around Hal. His geekiness might be contagious. And Hal, you should He's literally a programmer. Let him be. Come on. See you. Like, yeah, he's a bitch. But the, the, so mean rude to him. Literally, they're, they're not targeting the actual annoying hey, facet. Let me see that data card. Okay, I've copied over all the data. Here's your card back. I'm card two. Thanks, Hal. Like, I feel like I would like Hal a lot more if he was voice acted any other way. Yeah. Ah, no love up this time. Alright. Oh. Alright, well, babe, you know what time it is. It's time to look at... Wait, when did our character lose the gas mask? I don't... They must have taken it off at some point. They must have taken it off when we actually went to the red dimension again. Mm. Oh, right. Oh my god, remember this? Guys, do you want no. a lore dump? Oh. Okay, so these need a password. Yeah, there's your lore dump, everyone. <laughs> Simply pause the stream to read those. <laughs> Lovely. Literally, I don't, I don't give a shit. It's just about propaganda and stuff. Come find me on the roof. I need to talk to you. Ooh. Hey, Jen. <laughs> All right. So, let's see. We've, we've got plenty of time. Assuming we're stop assuming we're going to the same length of time rather than ending at the same point. Yeah, probably. I am getting tired, but like we can keep going for now. Yeah. Alright, so let's see, we got Marie's glasses. They're cute. <laughs> we've got goggles and we've got the bandage. So babe, glasses <laughs> or this? <laughs> So happy it covers the one visible eye. This is Allison. She has the plague. <laughs> so good. Like he doesn't. <laughs> I think I think we have to. We have to. Yes. <laughs> None face. <laughs> None face. Gone. Left hair. Goodbye. 
Don't forget the sing don't forget the singular minimalist earring we got out of the subway tunnels. No. I love it. Alright, and we can literally God. So fun fact, we can actually recolor the edit. We can actually recolor both the eye accessories and the mouth accessories. <laughs> Mm, now nah, let's change that one over to white. And then for the last one... There we go! <laughs> this is fashion. This is the future. It is. Now I think we'll just stick with the original colors for the bandage. <laughs> trying to think. Maybe... I think I have the mask in my game somewhat reversed in color scheme. Yeah, that looks a little better. Alright, I have to specifically save it. And there we go, Lou. It's great. It's wonderful. <laughs> Allison has the plague. You can't see shit, Captain. <laughs> Doesn't need to. It's not important. The only problem is it does in fact clip the hair. Who cares? Ooh. A small press to pay for not seeing bad <laughs> facial models. <laughs> this is like the most designed face. This is like the most we could have gotten this face looking. Literally can't see a thing. You always gotta keep your eyes peeled. <laughs> God, that looks stupid. Alright, dude. Literally, why would you even buy a stripped nut? He just buys junk from you. He's gonna melt them down and turn them into tchotchkes. Alright, let's get another upgrade. Ah, oh, god, these upgrades are so expensive. 26,000 gold, a rare and a pre- and two premium material codes to upgrade our weapon again. God. Like, ultimately, I don't know... Like, ultimately, I think my problem with the combat system is that it doesn't really seem to know what it's good at. It, this is very experimental, for sure. Okay, so, you know how we have fighting game inputs? Well, we have the spin attack, which apparently lets me do this. Like, Lenny's a fucking balloon. So good. Okay, so what does it look like as the other things? Okay, no, I guess because- it, I guess it'll be the same thing for every action command. In which case, let's see, we also have the air lesion thing. Which doesn't have any follow-up, right? Right. Literally, that's so underwhelming. <laughs> Literally, babe, that's so underwhelming. Why the hell does Lenny have, like, the most to do with that? Man, what a game this is. <laughs> Truly Don't... one of the games we've played. Don't forget, we have our line we have our lineup for this thing. Beast Scholar. 
Red matter remover. Slime splatter. So we get a new color slot for the lesions. Don't know what we'll do with it, but we have it now. Alright, just a bunch of material codes. And time to learn more things about the lesions. Can they kick ass? Yes. Let's see, we've got Hit Rush, where we can essentially let them off the chain to just attack by themselves for a bit. Oh, right, we have fighting input inputs on the lesions. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> that's awful. Obviously, we're getting that. Oh, of course. All right. Uh, anything else of interest? Let's see, Ace here doesn't have anything that we can afford and that I'm interested in. Other than the fact we can buy a 10% defense boost, which, okay. Power charge, perfect call, uppercut, all kinds of things. Right, we also have chain drive, which, uh, sets the train on the electric. <laughs> After which we can get Hit Rush, which it's okay. Let's give Arm... No. 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 <laughs> kazoon tight, kazoon tight. Excuse you. I guess we'll just buy this, just to say we have it. Alright, let's get going. Alright, there is mounted combat, but, like, why would you do it? <laughs> man, the new... Man, Elden Ring sure looks different. <laughs> <laughs> we can just do this forever, apparently. Hell yeah. We're doing Lovely. so much damage to the floor, babe. Good. Irreparable damage to the training room floor. I think we should be allowed to ride Arakel through the halls. <laughs> Why not? What are they gonna do? Stop us? Them and what army? <laughs> Them and what lesions? <laughs> Alright, Hal. Do you think we're actually gonna meet Hal, babe? No. Of course not. Who the hell's this dude? What? What am I taking a picture of? Don't. The heliport in general. <laughs> of course. Oh, there's Billy Williams. Billy Williams. Thanks, thanks, Billy Bill. You! God. Neuron really is overfunded. We've got three helicopters. What are we using them for, honestly? The At least they don't have weapons. All oh, right, this is what Hal looks like. God. Okay, sure. Bye. I have a feeling Bye. Like <laughs> Hi. Literally, who cares? You're not even a little curious. <laughs> okay, look. I'll cut to the chase. No matter how you look at it, Jenna is definitely trying to tell us something with this data card. He really? She is a terrorist. Quarantine or not. Yeah. We have definitively skipped vital information. <laughs> oh no, babe. Look, I don't know what's on that data card. I don't... What am I gonna do? Hand the data over to the government? Oh, they'll say they'll look into it. They're just talking about how there's gonna be another outbreak in Sector 9 that's gonna cause damage. If you got caught in there, they take your lead, I'll be fine. But if you re... Dude, you're just 
drone gets busted every everywhere you go. And it's not stealthy either. No, it's a Yeah, so, uh, we're going to be getting... next chapter? Depends on how long the chap- depends on when the cutoff of these chapters is, but essentially, we have this chapter, and then we have the next chapter, and then the next chapter we'll get the Axe Lesion. See, I see. But also, aren't you so excited to see Akira again? No. We're gonna see You're him not? at- we're gonna see him at the end of this chapter. It's gonna be the worst. I can I can feel it. Literally, who cares about the plot? Jen Anderson wants to do something for something, but she ends up just being a token villain who dies. <laughs> Yosef is going to be a token villain who dies, but he's the but he's the major and he's the twist villain, you see. Like, I don't even like Hal, but he's by far the most interesting character we've run into. He's the most interesting character because he flies a funny drone. Yeah, that's doing a lot for him. <laughs> Got, like, a personality. Allison being fucking Hot dog. Kind. Babe, hot dog. <laughs> uh, wait. <laughs> Beautiful. What do you think? The cyberpunk filter or the vignette? Like in, like in um, the Beatone. Makes it look like you're, you're a wee lass out of the fair <laughs> in 1932. With the plague. With the plague. You know how it is. With plague. <laughs> Alright. Alright, there's the advertising drones, which seem like they would be a problem, honestly. It feels like it would purely be distraction while driving. Birth of the Ark! It's a musical. No, fuck you. <laughs> Why is this even a mechanic? We're getting really? dock points for jaywalking. Oh, cool! That exact that dude who's redshifting earlier isn't here, but the cans are. Look, people have a routine, okay? They gotta drop their cans in exactly the same place every day. It's of special. course. Here, let's help this little girl. <laughs> this is a fucking bloodborne design. <laughs> The fact that the bandage isn't like an actual bandage, it just looks like a strip of cloth tied around your head. Yeah, no, it is, it's only there to look cool. Like that is a, like that is a Bloodborne look. Alright, here is the small child who like... Is it just me, or is this just a scaled-down model? Actually, it is a scaled-down model. Yeah, like... Like, the head proportion's alright, but then her body is very clearly just an adult woman. Yeah. No, oh, that's so bad. It's a small child with the tits. Oh. oh. Everyone's favorite anime trope. <laughs> we. It's so funny how you can just repeatedly hyper-dunk stuff. <laughs> Small child, why are you shoving me? <laughs> She's trying to push you into traffic! <laughs> God. Man with ice cream. Fuck dude, he sure is. Literally, you think it'd be a bigger part of our job to go around and blue shift people? mission that was like just you doing stuff like this in the city 
Um, it'd be a nice change of pace from the exact same mission structure every time. Can you even drive through this? I mean, I guess you could do, like, the world's fuckiest U-turn, but, like... <laughs> who knows? All right. All right, half-sized person. <laughs> All right, very clearly just an adult oh. model shrunken down. Yeah, her legs make it real obvious, don't they? <laughs> yeah. So good. <laughs> And Q4. No, I think I just got cop points. Congratulations. I don't want to be a good cop, though. Quickly! Quickly! Yeah! Be a menace. I find it immensely funny that while that while someone does get annoyed, we're not losing cop points for that. <laughs> they can never trace it back to you. They can't see what you're doing. I mean, literally all of Neuron can see lesions. <laughs> yeah, well, they don't care. But look. <laughs> like I kind of get the dating thing where you like want to taste each other's ice cream, but lady I don't think you're going th that. Literally, those scoops are so big; it's taller than your torso. <laughs> Comically large ice cream. Comically large, psychically floating ice cream. All right, babe. You want to see? Want to see something that sucks? <laughs> how do you? Sp God, literally, how expensive do you think this much ice cream is? Like. Ten dollars at least. This is a novelty item for tourists. Oog. Oog. <laughs> I wrote the dialogue for that character. Exactly. Come on, get them. What are you doing? You doing? I don't know what you're complaining about. You can't see this. Because as far as they know, you just went into, like, a power stance in the middle of the street for no reason. And then something blew up. It's so funny you're allowed to do that, actually. They probably think you're doing that with your mind. Ah, uh, we can't afford the avalanche special. Oh, no. Unfortunate. I guess we'll just get an extra large, then. I love how we're allowed to eat this, by the way. <laughs> yes, it is a balancing mechanic. I feel like this ice cream should come with like an insurance paper. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think the avalanche special is? Literally, literally, why is it tipping over like that? <laughs> I hate ice cream. Literally not even- Holy shit, that buff! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Literally, oh, that is such a huge buff, hello? <laughs> I wish ice cream did that in real life, come on! No. Hey, now you have no money! <laughs> Unfortunate. Abe. Look, I can't. Small child. Look, the small child will simply have to suffer. Literally, why can I? Why can we not? Why are your life savings on a cash chip? <laughs> oh, you know how it is. Why did you put your life savings on that? Literally, why? Gib. Uh, 
All right, Arakel. <laughs> Look at this funny dog you go. Now steal, steal her life savings to buy ice cream. You know for a fact that if this was a real cop, they would. A hundred gil. Thank you. <laughs> I wonder if there's like someone shady I can sell stuff to here. Literally, it's so funny that they set it up like this. Oh, wait. Now I think about it, don't be able to see me floating. Yeah, probably, seeing as they can't see the animal you're riding. <laughs> Learn how to levitate with this one easy trick. <laughs> one weird tip. You're not allowed to pick it up until it's come to a complete halt. <laughs> it's too dangerous otherwise. God, how many people have the plague? All. This is technically a vacation day for us. It is. Seriously, did we really have to do this? Nice arrest, Neuron. Wow. Let them do graffiti. Literally, who gives a shit? Like, the. Literally, this world is at an apocalyptic state, and you're still you're chasing down graffiti artists. People hate art. They do. Real quick, Vendor 3, what do you got for me? I still think Vendor 3 is like the best thing they've done here. It's the only thing, honestly. Oh, it's Carlos again. Oh. Uh -huh. Hi, Carlos. Sure. Thank you. Get down. I think we're inconspicuous no matter what. <laughs> Carlos, I, we are not built for stealth. that the man is a recruiter for the Z09 Liberation Front. Who are they? <laughs> Why, they are the they. I feel Thank like you. Carlos is supposed to be a comedy bit, but oh, like, it doesn't work. We ran foul of before. Carlos is just hunting down Look, the they thems of Ark. Why, why is her arm clipping into her pants? Don't worry about it. They designed the animation, assume they designed the animation without thinking about the massive chunky pants. Literally, we are the least subtle. <laughs> There's no subtlety here. Here. Oh, wait. Alright, dude, hurry up. We gotta tail the suspect, babe. <laughs> We're being oh so sneaky about it. In your bright pink armor. <laughs> In my bright pink body armor and this dog. Can't forget this dog. Which yeah, can this like suspect a thing. I love how oh right. Because they can physically exist. Oh, so he did bump into him. He just didn't you just did not- they're invisible, not intangible. Mm hmm Learning L.A. Noir hailing mission. Babe, we gotta do social stealth. <laughs> They'll never see us now. Beautiful. <laughs> 
Literally, dude, could you hurry up? He's gotta be stealthy going into some random alley. Quickly! What the <laughs> hell is Arakel tracking right now? I don't know. Oh! Yeah? Anime boy. Sorry, yeah. But I got us another prospect today. That makes ten this month. Hey, you idiot! You led the cops right to us! Use this and take them out. You know what happens if you fail. <laughs> no, just... I'm just gonna let them do this. Yeah, babe, it's rude to not let them power up. Just gonna let them power up. Bye! <laughs> Literally, what the fuck? Why did we just let them shoot up? He sat there for five minutes, facing Why did we let them shoot head. up and take Blue Evolve? Why did we just let them drink drugs? <laughs> you know, for fun. Why did they not show us them imbibing vials of Blue Evolve? Because they'd have to make an animation for that. Literally, these guys were redshifting, and at no point did we think that was suspicious. No, it's normal. God. Just talk about some nonsense, Rin. We don't know it yet, but Blue Evolve is actually the blood of people who are redshifting. Ah. When removed from the body, redshifted blood... When removed from the body, redshifted blood turns, like, purplish. By and by... Like, it doesn't... Like, it's safe-ish to use, in the sense that you can use it and not immediately aberrate. But it... And in return, as long as you're taking it, you are you have enhanced capabilities that let you fight chimeras. But you know, shockingly enough, maybe drinking radiation blood isn't a good thing. Perhaps not, no. Probably not. And they Literally, this plot is so much, because now we get to do the stealth section. Yippee! It, well, yes. not yet, but you know, it's coming up. <laughs> but first, why don't we get some shooting practice with this, with Joey here. Joey from Friends. Yeah, sure. Also, I think that's Alicia back there. Oh, no wait, course. no wait, that's just some lady. <laughs> woman spotted. <laughs> they put women in this video game. Did you know? Certainly not. <laughs> Motion controls. Yay, we love gyro controls. They're so good. <laughs> oh no, my multiplier. Not your multiplier, babe. Oh no. Flappy. Explosions! Cool stuff! Violence! So cool! <laughs> Shooting gallery! Hell yeah! Alright, Joey, you wanna hand me like 300 bucks? <laughs> Come on! 300 pennies, dude! <laughs> this is Sarah, who historically okay. does not talk.
But god, yeah, imagine getting paid enough to actually do stuff. <laughs> Nobody gets paid at Neuron. Literally, all of our funding goes towards just making- towards updating our gear. For some ungodly reason. <laughs> I cannot imagine how tall the avalanche special has to be. The avalanche special's gotta be like 20, 20 scoops. Yeah. You! But just, but just imagine the buff you'll get. <laughs> I just stole from public property. Hell yeah. That was a delivery drone. You were shooting down the Amazon drones with the crossbow. Drone spotted. <laughs> Too much range. Ten scoops. Jesus, what a nightmare. Babe, could you imagine ten? Good to know Arakel physically cannot cross those barriers. <laughs> Respects traffic boundaries, okay? Blue shifting, everybody's favorite wit. <laughs> such a That's such a violent grab. Beautiful. Alright, what else have we got? We've got more cans. Literally so many just random cans. City loves littering. Sure does. Oh, right, that's the way to Hal. Alright, so let's see what else is around here, because we'll probably call it right before we... We'll probably call it right before we see Hal. Yeah, that tracks. Literally, how did I not... Wait, how did I not know you have to use these things like the weird crystals? It never comes up as a problem. Because literally, how would you know? You know, just figure it out. It has no use in combat. Because it imme it's a means of traversal. That's... No, that one over there is just the kid with the ice cream problem. That we can't solve because we're broke. All right, Ace. Literally, why did we just shoot dr Why did we just shoot straight up medicine off of a truck? <laughs> Wait. Cause problems. <laughs> Wonderful. Alright, and... Can. Literally, there's so many cans on the map. There's too many cans on the map, I feel. There's also too many advertising drones. Perhaps. Perhaps, yeah. Literally, we smashed like eight of them at this point. It's great. Oh, too many, too many button presses. Ooh. That's arms for the Nintendo Slutch. <laughs> I fucking adore how he decided that's his name. You've decided that's his name, and I think it's funny, uh, so I go along with it. Babe, you're so correct for that. <laughs> I am, in fact, hot and funny. <laughs> A dangerous combination, wouldn't you agree? Literally, Hal, what would we do if I didn't have the ability to just break doors? Give up, I guess. Go Perish. into the sewers and... Go into the sewers and cry. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Alright, let's get going. Oh, come on. I'm not allowed to yank myself into the pit. Oh, of course not. Lame. Let me fall. Let me jump like I'm <laughs> let me jump like there isn't any fall damage. Cause there isn't. <laughs> There's bottomless pit damage, but that's different. Rachel, why? <laughs> why are you doing the Dill's voice? <laughs> She was doing this so, so much last night. <laughs> <laughs> why, why have you done this? Afflicted by the curse. Ah, come on. Why is there not a no option? <laughs> you just say no and walk back out. The game just kind of moves on without him. All right, babe. We gotta, we gotta be discreet. We gotta go incognito. Oh, of course. We gotta wear that small child outfit. You'll never know. It's it's not like you're wearing a police hat and you know a giant brick on your wrist. <laughs> it's not like the Legatus is subtle or anything. Afflicted by the curse. <laughs> okay, so here's the thing. We could we could do the stealthy, which guarantees getting the S plus rank, or we could just book it. However, mm. what you don't understand is that we're fucking done for the day. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, do you do you want to do the stealth section? No. Exactly. All right, everyone. <laughs> Besides, if the chill's voice is creeping in now, that means it's a bad thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope everyone has had a lovely time with us. I hope everyone has had a lovely day, and I hope. You all have a good time. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs>